So in the case of our end table here, if I wanted to add a bevel to the top surface, I can select the top circle has my edge and activate the bevel tool. This also locks that selection in as you can see. And now I can pick a reference point to drag and set the distance. Notice how you get this orange highlight which acts as a preview to the bevel effect. From here you can click again to confirm the distance at 8 segments. As you can see it's actually very simple and the more you do it the more familiar you get used to the operation. But let's repeat this with the bottom circle. So in the same way I'm going to select my circle, activate bevel and instead of the click and drag I'm going to double click to repeat and apply the last setting. So this is going to be the same distance and the same number of segments.